South Western Sydney and of course the Blue Mountains. Here's what he's had to say in his most recent update. More particularly uh, west of the uh, Chapman Parade uh, over towards Oaks, Oaks Road area. Uh, the message in that location has been to shelter in place uh, and firefighters uh, are in there uh, working to protect uh, the people in the path of that fire uh, and look after look after the homes uh, along the along the road and all the side streets uh, along Oaks Road. The weather uh, forecast uh, continues to firm up as being uh, problematic uh, over the next 48 hours, uh, with a continuance of similar conditions uh, to today, albeit a marginal reduction in temperatures for tomorrow. Uh, before we see those elevated uh, wind strengths uh, dominate much of the far affected areas uh, but also more broadly uh, right up through uh, the Hunter uh, and the, and the um, uh, Central Ranges, Metropolitan and Illawarra regions, uh, we can expect to see uh, most of those areas with widespread severe fire danger ratings uh, and as so I mentioned earlier, uh, potentially uh, even parts of those locations, particularly Greater Sydney, uh, may also be experiencing extreme fire danger rating conditions. The mix of air has been uh, quite challenging uh, throughout today once again uh, with the combination uh, of the nor'westerlies uh, moving across the mountain range uh, and then being met uh, by an easterly influence uh, off the coast uh, which is getting through to the western areas of Sydney uh, and there's quite a mixing uh, of those two um, um, different uh, direction winds along the escarpment uh, which has had some uh, direct effect uh, on the Springwood fire ground particularly uh, and of course the, um, um, the Bilpin end uh, of, the, of the Lithgow fire. We are expecting that northeasterly influence uh, to dissipate uh, over the over the coming 24 hours, uh, and certainly uh, not be having the effect that it has been for the last couple of days. Uh, by the time we hit Wednesday, we are starting to experience uh, a fair bit of smoke drift across the Sydney Basin, um, as as was expected, uh, and I expect that this will only increase uh, as the next 24 to 48 hours uh, rolls along. Uh, and that, that will probably um, uh, further thicken up uh, with the benefit of nightfall. Shane Fitzsimmons there, the uh, Rural Fire Services uh, Commissioner, and his latest update. The next one's scheduled to come through at uh, 8 o'clock, or just after 8 o'clock, on uh, 12.33 ABC Newcastle. Something new for you in just a moment with... Uh... There you go. And the Chuffs, once again, are operating as mining engineers. Google's on a lot of the YouTube. Ciao.